Oh hey, it's me. Welcome to another fake toys video. Today I've got some great things that I've been saving up to show you guys. Okay, so pretty much all of these are fake My Little Pony things, except for one thing. You know, I thought I would stop doing these fake toy videos, but I keep seeing like hilarious fake things and I just want to like make a video on it because it's funny. So yeah, I'm just gonna keep doing these videos until I stop finding fake things. If you're wondering, I find these kind of things in like dollar stores, but usually they're not a dollar. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna save the best thing for last because um, it's pretty great. And we're going to start with this. <laughs> wow, isn't it beautiful? This is a pony in an egg. Wait, I think I have two of these. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, yes, here's the other one. So these are just these weird egg things with some like fake small ponies in it. I thought these are pretty interesting because like, oh Jesus. Where'd he go? I thought these are pretty interesting because like, why are they in an egg? Like, so it's a random. They come with these uh, random like heart stickers and a little pony. So these, both of these are from like the little, uh, what do they call them? Like Apple Family sets that came out a while ago, but they're just like one color. Honestly, the quality isn't too bad. This is so weird. They just like snap open like violently. And here's the other one is the hat. Oh my god. You can even remove the hat like you can with the original one. These remind me of like the uh, special mushlings you could get back when Mushy Monsters was a thing. One series of special mushlings were green and no one wanted them because why would you want green mushlings? Like, I know I don't. And they came with the exact same stickers. Wow, how interesting. There was actually one thing I saw that I didn't buy and I'm really annoyed that I didn't buy it, but it was like, it was like a fake pony, like a filly pony, a baby pony with a lollipop in it, which I thought was very interesting and um, probably poisonous. So I, I didn't buy it, but um, I kind of wish I did because that would be kind of funny if I died on camera, you know, because of a fake pony. <laughs> What the f- that just flew across my room, so let's just ignore that. Next, we have this. A, uh, white Princess Luna with, um, Princess Celestia colored hair. Oh, but- but don't worry. There's more. What? Okay, that's honestly kinda cool. This is, um, this is like the mold of the snow globe ponies, I think. Cause it's got like the hooves stuck together and stuff. Um, they had some other colors. They had like, um, a blue one and I think they had a pink one too, like painted like Princess, uh, what's her name? Cadence. But yeah, this one just looks like Celestia with Luna's cutie mark. I mean, also not bad quality to be honest. It has one of these like symbols on it for that terrible My Little Pony app that came out that you could like scan the ponies or something. So I wonder if it actually works. Probably because they probably just completely copied it from the original one. Um, this is about 250 I think. Quite the bargain if I do say so myself. Okay, this one is very interesting because mixed with quite a lot of different fake things, it says it's a pick me pop, which um, I don't have any pick me pops. Pick, pick me pops, but I'm pretty sure they're like these like little plushies that come out of these lollipop shape things But um, this is in the shape of a suitcase. It even has the instructions of a pick me pop on the back I don't think this is a uh, The same thing. Um, it also has a pony on it like What? This is so weird. There's just a random like baby pony in it and then it has these like characters. I don't know if they're from Pick Me Pop or not. It says find lovely and shiny Pick Me Pops. Yeah, this is so weird. But uh, inside it is uh, something pretty amazing. You can kind of see it, but um, I'm gonna open it so we can see what it is. W wait, what the heck? There we go. It actually does have a fake Pick Me Pop in it, but oh my god, it squeaks. Is this like what the pick me pops look like? But I'm pretty sure they're plushies. They aren't like plastic. Uh-oh. No, it's not a toy. Probably like poisonous. Honestly, this is kind of cute apart from like the mouth being like in the wrong place. But um, they try their best. And it also comes with, uh, I don't know what these are supposed to be. Is this like supposed to be a bottle? Oh, is this supposed to be like, a lol doll bottle? This looks like one. I could be wrong. I haven't had a lol doll before. And this is 
<laughs> this is supposed to be one of those ponies that you can like snap together. Wait, can I? Oh my god, I can! Um, these are, I don't think they make these ponies anymore because like they weren't very popular. But um, you just snap them together and stuff and you can like change the hairstyles and whatever. Oh my god, I can't get this back on. This is so annoying. Um, I'm not sure whose hair this is supposed to be. Maybe Rainbow Dashes or something. But uh, it has blue eyes, um, two different cutie marks. I don't know who's this cute mark supposed to be. This one's supposed to be DJ Pwn3. And it also comes with wings, because uh, why the heck not? This just looks like someone's OC. So this one is like probably the weirdest thing, because like, what is all this? Why? And what is this suitcase thing from? Like, honestly, the suitcase is kind of cute. You can even take the handle out and there we go. It can be like a doll suitcase or whatever. That's honestly pretty damn cute. But um, it's also very weird and like, I don't get it. Okay, so do you guys remember in uh, my last fake toy video, I met this beautiful creature. Well, I've got good news because I found another fake sea pony thing. But this time it's Pinkie Pie with a unicorn horn. Just why? Also, I like how she has Rarity's hair in this picture. It says lovely horse up here. This was $5.90. Jesus Christ, please save me. My lovely horse with like a random hat there for some reason. Got Fluttershy with some flowers in her hair. This like, this really strange art. I'm not sure if this is just fan art. Cause we've got Twilight with Rarity's hair. Um, Rarity's wearing some kind of dress and Pinkie Pie's got pigtails. Dear horse, super cute, hurry up to collect them. Why does it say dear horse? Hello, come and collect us. Okay, um. Oh, she just popped right out. There's like some random background from something. It's kind of cute to be honest. I wonder what people think when I go into the store and just buy a bunch of like fake stuff. Like, do they do they know it's fake? And they're like, <laughs> this idiot just brought some fake ponies. But in reality, I know what's fake. You ain't fooling me. All right, here she is. Here's, whoa, her hair is kind of cool to be honest. So here's our fake Pinkie Pie sea pony with uh, a unicorn horn. She's got some weird thing around her neck. But she does actually have her cutie mark. It's on her fin. Is that what they look like in the movie? I don't know. But um, which one do you think is worse? I, I think the Applejack one is a bit a bit worse. Yeah, she's got like a dangly thing on her head. Like these would probably be good to make like a custom sea pony out of if you wanted to or something. Here is the thing you've all been waiting for. Dun dun dun. I I don't know either man. <laughs> so I just saw this the other day and I thought I just had to get it like I mean I mean look at it. So it was $14 which honestly I expected it to be more expensive. So this is my happy horse happy time. Um, it's got some random fake pony pictures on the sides here for some reason. Fashion horses, lovely horses, a barrel of fun best friend. Well, this show looks like a barrel of fun. Um, it comes with a random pink castle and the power ponies uh, is what these are, th are supposed to be, I'm pretty sure. And what's very interesting is they all have like plastic hair, which I thought was very strange and, and different because I don't think you can even get real ponies with plastic hair apart from like minifigures. And um, the best part is that it has the villain from the Power Ponies episode, but as a normal looking pony. Uh, this is so strange and like, uh, I don't know, this is so weird, but we're gonna open it up. We got another fake pony on the side. We got some more random fake ponies in the back. Um, got these terrifying fake like baby ponies. These look like uh, generation 3.5 baby ponies or something like that. Cause I remember when I was a kid, I had a, a baby pony toy, the ones that like talk to you and stuff and I hated it. But uh, <laughs> yes, that was before generation four came out. Imagine if you were a kid and you asked your parents for like My Little Pony for Christmas and um, you got this or, or you got this. Oh my god. Okay. Okay, we've got another random background. And they're made out of this really cheap plastic. Like, it's just, they shouldn't be made out of this. It just looks bad and it looks like McDonald's toys, you know? Here's our castle. 
Um, oh, the door opens. Oh my god. And it's literally just half a castle. Honestly, the castle's kind of cute. I feel like I could like make something out of this, you know? This is so strange. And like the inside of her wings are even hollow. Okay, so this one is definitely the weirdest to me. Like, why did they even bother making this into a pony? I'm gonna, like, Google what she looks like. MLP, Power Ponies, Villain. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it is supposed to be her, because she has the same eyes. But, like, why has she got, like, this suit on? Doesn't really look like her suit. But, um, they tried. <laughs> they tried their best. Is there a pony figure of her? I don't know. And her eyes, look how off-center her eyes are. And this is Applejack with really short hair her like mask thing looks really weird it looks like it's been like spray painted on she does not really look a whole lot accurate i mean they, they try their best okay this is supposed to be rarity with uh an orange horn and pink short hair her hair looks really cool honestly like i don't know where they got this mold from i kind of like how their hair is molded Easy to deal with. I mean, her outfit, it looks pretty accurate. Twilight has the same hairstyle as Rarity, I think, and she's got a white horn. Her one, oh, they didn't even try. <laughs> Half her face is just red. Like, oh, what? Uh, Rainbow Dash, um, yeah, she's all right. She just got purple hair. I'm surprised they even gave her different hair mold to the other ponies. It's weird how they only gave Rainbow Dash like an accurate hammer to what it looks like when she's uh, a power pony, but the rest of them are just this this short hair mold. Not sure who it's supposed to be from. Applejack does have a different hair mold though, but the rest of them are exactly the same. Um, here's Fluttershy, who also has a horn for some reason. Um, a blue unicorn horn. Fluttershy is an alicorn now apparently. She's got a red mask for some reason instead of purple. I don't know. I mean, honestly. I think these are kind of cool since they have like the molded hair. Like if if I still made my little pony videos, I could like use these to make male customs out of or something. Or just ponies with short hair because um trying to like make short hair out of um pony hair is, is very difficult and it always just looks kinda terrible. But these would actually be really cool for um male customs or whatever like even the mohawk one but also you have that like weird shiny plastic which will be quite annoying it's like the power ponies is males or something <laughs> wait i have one more thing that i'm gonna open in this video um it's not my little pony but i thought i would include it anyway because i also <laughs> it's also fake but this is a fake pokemon or should I say, Pokemon Go stationary set. It was $3. Um, I really like this one because it says Pokemon Go and then it has Detective Pikachu on it. <laughs> oh, sorry. Let's, oh God, open it up. It would be even better if they had um, the new Detective Pikachu on it the, uh, for the live action movie coming out. Okay, here's our wallet. Oh yeah, I'm gonna put all my money in this. <laughs> Oh, it's so tidy. Fake companies are still using Pokemon Go on all their fake Pokemon stuff to try and get more money and it's just like, why? Pokemon Go isn't even that popular. We just got a random yellow pencil sharpener, which is probably really terrible. It's got a Pokemon. Uh, oh, we got two Pokemon pencils that also have Take the Pikachu on there. Pokemon Go to the pole and a Detective Pikachu. Pokemon Go, little tiny eraser. Oh, we've got a we've got a roller too. This is wait, what? This is just a piece of paper. This is not even a real roller. Are you serious? Dude, I feel ripped off with my $3. Honestly though, like how cheap can you get that you can't even have a real plastic roller? Okay guys, thanks for watching another video about fake toys. If you guys enjoy these, let me know. Um, I'll probably do more of them whenever I find, like, different fake stuff around. They're pretty fun to make despite being a total waste of money, but, uh, yeah. Thank you guys for watching, I'll see you in the next video. Bye!